Hey what's up guys welcome to Linux Tech In this video we will be seeing how to install Linux Mint on your desktop or laptop Let's begin by booting into a live session using a DVD or USB stick The link to the instruction video to make a bootable USB stick is given in the description Once you have booted into a live session begin the installation by directly clicking on install Linux Mint Select your language from this list and click on continue I suggest that you select the first option that is do not connect to a Wi-Fi network right now because this simplifies many things during installation. Click on continue. Next, select the option to install third party software. This installs many essential components for the smooth functioning of the operating system. It might take up to 5 minutes to load the next options. Do not interrupt the process and let it just take its time. I will fast forward 5 minutes. Next, the installation type screen will be displayed. If you already have a Windows or other operating system installed on your computer and want to install Linux Mint while retaining the old OS, then I suggest that you select the first option, that is install Linux Mint alongside them and click on continue. The second option will delete all the drives on your hard drive, programs, documents, photos, music and any other files and all the operating systems. So it is recommended that you do not use the second option unless you know what you are doing and it is what you want. In this video I will be dealing manually with the partitions. So click on something else and continue. You can see that I have multiple operating systems installed on my computer. Click on the partition that you want to install Linux Mint on and click on change. Click on use as drop down and select ext4 journaling file system. Click format the partition and select the mount point as slash. The slash in a Linux file system is technically known as root. Click on okay. Click continue on any of the prompts that are going to be displayed. Please wait while the new partition is created. Click on install now. If you get prompts regarding swap space, just ignore them by clicking on continue. Next, select your time zone. Again, it might take some time to load the next screen. Select your desired keyboard layout and click on continue. In this screen, fill all the required details and click on continue. Be careful with the password. And your work here is done. Now you just wait for the operating system to be installed. This might take up to 20 minutes. A slide show will introduce you to your new operating system while the OS gets installed. Once the installation procedure is complete, you will see the restart dialog box. Click on restart now. That's it. You have now successfully installed Linux Mint on your computer. Welcome to the world of Linux. I wish you an amazing journey with Linux. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome Linux news, tips, tutorials and more. This is Linux Tech signing out.